Here's a 2019 Kia Sorento LX, 9,000 miles in white. Uh, good looking vehicle here, uh, five passenger SUV, all wheel drive. LX is uh, kind of a step up from the S, a little uh, kind of uh, second tier trim, I guess you would say. We're just gonna kind of walk the car and show you what you get. Uh, you do get the smoked headlamps with the uh, pods there with the high intensity uh, lights. Uh, no fog lights in the lower bumper fascia come around to the side see we do have a split spoke alloy wheel and of course light new tires only 9,000 miles you also can see a nice shiny rotor and thick brake pad it's one thing we really pride ourselves here at all things automotive we do use car mechanical check on all our vehicles find a result in that inspection signed up by the technician that performed it in the glove box of our cars peek through the passenger side front seat see uh, manual adjustment on the seat light gray cloth covered seating two bucket seats console with an automatic floor shifter in between and otherwise kind of gray on gray interior see if we got that condition report in the glove box here for you you can see we do have the books and you'll find all the wearables are pretty much light new here 830 seconds on the tires brand new or 10 or so so we're 80 percent or better and then light new brakes we do not want you to, have to spend any money on reconditioning we always make sure all the wearables have been uh, checked over and we replace if they are uh, less than half worn everything's light new in this case obviously only 9,000 miles look through the uh, second row here of seating and I'm sorry it is a seven passenger SUV you can see the third row of seating back there so it does give you that seven passenger ability uh, but looking at the second row bench you can see that it does have uh, 12 volt power supplies and USB connections down there at the bottom. We also got a flow through center console. Uh, so it's nice that you do have those options there. Also, we got these uh, Dynapros all the way around. Like I say, good tread on the tires. It is a V6. I believe they do put four cylinders in these. So the six cylinder is nice uh, to have on this size vehicle. You see it does have a, a backup camera as well. Manual lift gate. But like I say, seven passenger here, as you can see, uh, three rows of seating. And you can fold these seats down, obviously, here with the pull strap. Simple, you can see, one, one pull, one pull flips the headrest, down they go. It doesn't get any easier than that for seven passenger seating. To pull them up, that simple, just pull it back up, flip your headrest up, and it's about as easy as it comes when it comes to something like that. So uh, let's go ahead and continue the tour. Let's see there, say the wheels are all in good shape. And it's a very, very clean interior. Even still has that new car smell, no rips, tears, stains, or odors. Previous owner was a non-smoker. Take a look through the passenger side front. See full power seat on the driver's side. Also does have your power windows, your uh, power mirrors, and your power door locks all located right there. Also, we always promise two sets of keys. I have one with me right now. See the trunk release and the integrated keyless entry. Let's go ahead and jump in. See there, oh, it went off. Let me get it back on for you. 9,942 miles. So like I say, kind of like new. Uh, we're going to kind of go over the tour here some of your options you can see it does have blind spot You can see the insignias in the mirror there. You can turn that on and off with this button uh, It does have the dimmer switch for your interior traction control and a fuel release door Headlamp controls are in the outside of the left stem high beams and turn signals as well Intermittent wiper washers Bluetooth is here with your audio controls on your steering wheel Cruise is over here with your menu button which will toggle your center display AM FM satellite radio here on a touch screen does have dual climate control and I tell you the air blows nice and cold it's uh, feels real nice in here down below you can see 12 volt power supply auxiliary and USB uh, we also got your floor shifter here with the ability to select any of the gears do have the ability to toggle your drive mode and lock in your four-wheel drive which is nice not all all-wheel drives give you that ability uh, you do have two cup holders in the console another 12 volt power supply these new cars keep you connected uh, we do have the ability to toggle on the, the light switch if the doors are open, two LED lights. We do have illuminated visors on the driver and the passenger, as you can see there. Um, so it's got everything you need, a lot of connectivity, a lot of nice options. 
Uh, the other thing we always give you, we always put a copy of the Carfax here on the dash. Now, in this particular vehicle, there was an accident. The airbags did deploy, uh, and we'll go over that vehicle. There's a couple of little things on the front I'll go over with you here as we get into the next part of the video. But uh, otherwise, it was a one owner, uh, uh, low mileage, and like I say, we're always full disclosure there. Uh, we always make sure we have that on all our vehicles. Uh, so let's go ahead and pop the hood take a look at the engine like I say it is a v6 engine there you can see it's clean and quiet no exhaust leaks or fluid leaks corrosion on the battery terminal well maintained obviously only 9,000 miles so it looks like a brand new engine bay in here turn the vehicle off and we'll get in the last portion of the video and just to recap 80% or so on your tires like new brakes all the way around uh, and uh, like I said did have the accident with the airbag deployment uh, so we're just gonna kind of look for little signs there's a couple of little chips there on the front bumper um, across the hood here if you it's awful hard for you guys to tell I can see just little tiny pieces of uh, dirt when they painted it that did get underneath the clear coat. Uh, it ain't gonna affect anything, but uh, you know, if you're looking for it, which we are, we know it was in a, an accident situation. Uh, you can see just a couple little pieces of dirt underneath the paint. Uh, there's a little uh, blemish that was touched up. Uh, otherwise, just a couple stone chips. Uh, the rest of the car, uh, the front end obviously has been repaired and shows some signs. The rest of the car is not too bad. Uh, looks pretty good. Uh, a couple little stone chips uh no dents or dings a couple there on the rear uh, hatch looks pretty good um, quarter panel looks fine chip right there but all in all roof line looks fine say so no real dents or dings just a couple little stone chips there now the fender uh, was painted as well and there's a couple little specks of dirt in it like on the other fender a um, little spot down here on the, the bumper cover where some of the clear had, uh, had come off after they painted it. Uh, the rest of the bumper cover looks fine. And uh, like I said, there's really no stone chips on this since the hood was uh, recently repainted. But all in all, guys, uh, very efficient, uh, very low mileage, seven passenger SUV that won't break your budget and has all the options you'd like. Um, does still have the remainder of uh, warranties transferable to the next owner, so you can buy it with confidence. If you're interested, there's a couple ways of getting a hold of us. Come visit us, 21518 Great Cove Road in McCollinsburg, Pennsylvania. Uh, you can give us a call, area code 717-485-4224, hit option one for sales. And, of course, you can shop 24-7 online at www.allthingsautomotive.com. Again, my name is Kevin Richards. I appreciate your time watching this video. I hope you found it beneficial, and I wish you an excellent day.